Hello guys, welcome to Vincistech.com and we will see how to record and play the scripts in Selenium IDE. Right? So in the previous video, I shown you how to install Selenium IDE. So now we will see how to record some scripts and play the scripts in Selenium IDE. Right? So first open Firefox browser. Then open the Selenium IDE. You have a shortcut icon here, Selenium IDE, or you can open from at the top menu tools and click on Selenium IDE. Right now, you can see a red button here, and you can see if you mouse over, you can see click to record. Right, so click the button, right, and again mouse over, you can see now recording click to stop recording okay if you want to stop the recording now you have to click again here right now go to browser and open any website say I will open selenium website seleniumhq.org and I will click on the links projects download documents support about and again back to projects and I will click on the logo Selenium HQ it will go to home page right so now if you go and observe in the IDE window it's recorded some scripts here right so now stop the record and here you have one slider fast and slow okay so that means it's controlling of the speed of the run right here you have two icons again if you have a single test case you have to click on this button like play current test case and if you have multiple test cases like a suites so you can run this one so we'll see in another video what about the suite how to create the suite right so coming to this program is a single test we have here that's the only test i have here play current test case okay so click this button and minimize that See, you can see some actions going on like this is very quick so like this you can see here as well the runs like total runs are 1 and failures are 0 and you can see the log files here and at the last line you can see test case passed means there is no errors so how to save a test so file save test case I'll go to desktop create some folder here sample ID scripts and save as test case one okay so here you no need to give any extension like not HTML whatever you no need to give just give the test case name as a file name and save as type all files that would find so click on save right so close the IDE minimize the browser and open the folder here you can see this is a test case one which you just recorded and it converted means it saved automatically as a HTML document means by default ID scripts if you save it will save as a HTML document so if you, you right click and open with say I want to open with notepad and you can see this is a HTML code okay I think you know what is HTML what is uh, a table TD like that so it will be stored like a table in HTML okay so even if you open this in a browser you can see this is a table in HTML and it is recorded like this and if you observe the same window in IDE say tools open IDE and open the test case So if, if you observe here both right 
so here open and here you can see open and this is a test case one this is a test case name and click and wait this is a command and this is the action okay so this is how you can record a script and play a script if you want to run again so open make sure you have firefox browser is open even you can be in empty so you are in just google page now and go and run the script see it's open selenium website and uh, it did all your actions right so this is about how to record a script and run a script okay you can have multiple test cases as well here so file new test case this is a new test case give the name here or file save test case test case 2 save we have test case 2 now and I have not recorded anything so you can record now again so click to record and now this time open another website so I am clicking the menu here different different pages like this and see here you can see it's recorded some actions stop recording and you can see star here that means you have not saved the script okay so if you save the star will go okay now the script is saved so I will run this test case you can see it's clicking all the links right so this is how to create a test case how to record a script how to run a script right thank you for watching the video